Hey YouTube Opinionator Reviewer here and in this video I'm going to show you guys how to jailbreak iOS 5.0 Beta 3 with Red Snow 0.9.8 Beta 2. Now this is a Tether jailbreak and Red Snow have been updated so the App Store problem is no more and you're going to have to point Red Snow to the iOS 5 Beta 1 IPSW. So I'm going to have all the links in the description where you can get all these stuff. And you're going to right click Red Snow, click Properties, Compatibility, run this program in Compatibility Mode 4, Windows Service Pack 2, check Run this program as an administrator, click Apply and then click OK. Now you're going to run Red Snow. and you're going to locate the iOS 5 beta 1 not beta 2 or beta 3 beta 1 IPSW this is mine right here Red Snow has identified click next and we're just going to leave it at install studio and that's it I'm going to click next so now we're going to put our iDevice into a DFU mode. We're going to hold the power button for 3 seconds, hold the power and the home button for 10 seconds, release the power button, keep on holding the home button for 15 seconds or until Red Snow recognizes your iDevice. We don't have to click next, we're just going to do it and it's going to recognize when we go into DFU mode. So we're going to go 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, release, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and there goes Red Snow. So I'm going to let Red Snow work, it's magic, I'm going to come back when it's finished. So now that Red Snow is finished, you're going to realize that your Cedia and your Safari is crashing. Don't worry about that. That's completely normal for a Tether jailbreak. What we're going to do is boot it up Tethered with Red Snow. So we're going to click Red Snow and run it again. We're going to browse for the same IPSW firmware. iOS 5 Beta 1, not Beta 3. We're going to click Next. And now we're just going to click Just Boot Tether. And we're going to click Next. We're going, to hold, we're going to do the same thing, put it in DFU mode. We don't have to click Next. We're just going to do it. And Red Snow is going to start when it's ready. So let's go 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Now we're going to let Red Snow do its thing again. So now that Red Snow is finished, your Cydia and your Safari should be working like normal. That's it. You're now jailbroken. Remember, it's tethered, so every time your battery dies, or you turn off your phone or you reboot you have to use Red Snow to boot it tethered for Safari and Cydia to be working with that being said please rate, comment, subscribe have a nice day